All right. Oh no, I forgot the music. That's bad. Hold on. Hold up. I'm sorry. Um. Anyway, welcome to today. It's. it's not, oh man, I'm all over the place today. It's Saturday. Welcome, welcome to the Saturday stream. Um. So today I am gonna be doing a whole lot of uh, building things. Uh. And mostly preparing for the um, forest, uh, and I will get to that in a sec here. Let me just that, and uh, yeah. So basically, I uh, I got a lot planned to sort of organize things and sort of get things prepared for the fantasy uh, stuff. Um, little bit more there we go. okay so yeah the um the plan is to basically prepare today um but yeah obviously before that as per usual we got to uh look at some other people's stuff so i think we we're around here oh yeah we, we definitely looked at those mushrooms and i gave my my two cents on that um there is some um, Detailed this thing. Uh, wildly intricate. Okay. Hmm. Very simple ground, but I like the buildings. So, that's a shield, that's a sword, that's a helmet, spear, book. I would have liked some, like, little text on the book. That, that would have that added a lot. Some, like, scribble sort of look to the, the papers. I think that would have. But it definitely added a lot. But it's not bad. I like I like how well this blends into this. Uh, looks like they sort of just used the cliff to carve out their castle instead of building the castle on there. You know, I like that. Good detailing. Good stuff. Ooh, what a tree! Nice. Good tree. Hold on. Hold on. Tweeted myself. That is a fantastic. I love this tree. Well done. Well done. Indeed, well done. Who is this? Who done did it? Oh, I'm already following them. Good. They deserve it. Oh, it's the person who made this. Wow, they have a thousand likes on that now. That's amazing. Awesome. They deserve it. Um. All right. Chainsaw Man. <laughs> it's a very funny name. All right. Wow, this is taking a long, uh, a long time to load. Why is that not loading properly? Right, well, I love all of this stuff. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, again, this is sort of that like it looks like they carved it out of the thing rather than just building it there, or at least partially did that. Um. Oh. He's now making um, these these things too. I kind of see. I'm okay with this. This is the sort of plant thing that I'm okay with. With with the angles, I feel like this is more logical than sort of any other angles that might be. But even this is still just something where I'm like, that would never happen in actual Minecraft. Like in default, you know, you would still never have something at a 45 degree angle. Like never ever would something be angled in Minecraft. Uh, like a texture or anything like that. At the most, at the very most, it'll be angled on the Y axis. Never the uh, Z or the X. Um, so, basically, like the uh, the bush plants or any of the plants, basically, that like grass or ferns or anything like that that you can put down, that can be angled on the Y axis. But you can never angle a thing like that on the, uh, the Z or the X axis. So you can never angle something like this way, you know, this way, this way, like towards my face, towards the camera, you know, these these ways. But you can angle something, you know. Let me, let me, uh, let me, uh, <laughs> let, me let me, oh crap. <laughs> my thing got fudged up because I changed some settings. My bad, let me, let me, let me fix it. 
It's all good. It's all good. Just pretend you didn't see anything. All right. So anyway, this, these angles right here, never. All right. Minecraft would never do these angles, but on the Y axis, this angle, they would do that. They would totally do a like Y angle thing, but never, never this and never this, if that makes sense. Okay. I, I, <laughs> I know that's weird, but yeah, like it's just something to keep in mind when you're designing like just, you know, plants and crap in Minecraft. Like it's really hard to make it look like default because that is just a, it's a very specific thing that you have to sort of keep in mind all those little, little things that go into it. And uh, yeah, it definitely has a certain look. I love this castle. This is uh, got a lot of nice looking towers. Uh, this is a very unrealistic, unnavigatable thing, but looks good. It's also very nice texturing. Very nice. Texturing. Um, yeah, good detailing. I like it. Much to look at. Also good texturing. I like those textures for those bricks and stuff. I'm not sure what texture pack they're using. Let me see. Actually, did they say? I mean, no, they're probably using like a, a custom one. Um, hmm. nice little box in here. To a tree. <laughs> you know, I I actually I kind of like this overall. Like the overall look of this tree is really good. But personally, I just these leaves irk me because obviously there's no like actual branches in the leaves. Like you can see in this one right here, this branch just kind of comes to a point and then there's just like big chunk of leaves around it it's a design choice i mean it it doesn't look bad <laughs> i'm just saying that's it's something i would never do in my own tree <laughs> Ooh. see this up until these little fruit pieces is definitely something i could see in default because the warpiness yeah that happens but like for the most part, it's only angled on the y-axis, except for these little fruit pieces being slightly angled on the z and the x. Other than that, this is this very default looking. Good job. Um, I feel like I need to need to uh, start liking all of this stuff because he's uh he's obviously going beyond the um. Oh wait, no, this is totally somebody else. He's posting it, but somebody else is doing it. Who's doing this? Hold on. Who is this person? So, is this the same person? Or... Like, with a different account? Another model done. I want to assume that it is, right? So, yeah, this is the one that I also... <laughs> I, I realize now that I'm, I'm, like, super judging all of his stuff. Also, I realize I never gave any of these likes. I, I do like these things. Um... But yeah, I are they the same person? Is is uh, three exu the same as um, whatever Misty Mind, or is Misty Mind a different person and they're just putting it on there for them? Interesting. Ooh, I really like the bottom of this. That is beautiful. Just all the different sort of shapes and stuff that are going on there. Beautiful. Good stuff. Good stuff. Hold on. That one deserves a like as well. For sure. And a retweet. I'm gonna I like me some trees. Good trees. Good trees. <laughs> oh look! <laughs> Another truck on a road. That's so this one's huge too. This one's got pumpkins though. They 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 outdid me for sure. Uh, they also put like words and stuff on the tires. This one's wild. Is that uh that's in, that's insane. Oh, Instagram. Wait, what? Oh, I didn't realize it was Instagram. Well, I can't like, like it because it's Instagram, but I will maybe log into my Instagram. Right. I do need to post on Instagram more. I didn't realize that. I am not good at doing that. All right, we're, we're getting a little far into things here. But I like that. Really good texturing. I think it also has some like 3D-ness to it, but that, even without the 3D-ness, that's, that's just really good texturing. Um, I want to, honestly, this kind of looks like they did it from a, um, whatchamacallit, uh, a sprite craft, um, 
thing. So, pixelated. It's turning the picture into pixels or into blocks. And that's definitely like conquest or something. Bloodborne. What? That's got to be conquest or Mithrentia uh, or something like that. Usually when they use those kind of texture packs, they put a hashtag in it. But... Hmm. Not bad, not bad. Good little, little simple terrain. No trees or anything, though. Um... Hmm. Not sure about the really giant pumpkins, especially this one in the middle. I think these ones on the edge kind of work because they're, like, on the outskirts. But I don't know about that one in the middle. That's kind of weird. Like, uh... <laughs> the giant peach... Should make a giant pumpkin movie. It's a spin-off from the, the giant peach. Also, definitely has to be stop motion. 100 percent What? The endless cycle of life. This is cool. Look at this. Do I follow you? Because this is a weird tweet on my phone. First of all, oh I don't. I am gonna follow you too. I like this. You got some good stuff going on. You got some good voxel art going on. This is voxel art. This is definitely not Minecraft. Oh, that's Minecraft, but this is voxel art. There's no way this is Minecraft. This is just straight up voxel art. It might be Minecraft, but like it looks like voxel art, so that's props to them. It is Minecraft. Oh no, it's definitely somebody else that retweeting. I'm dumb. Oh, it's the same person that did this. I didn't even realize. Nice. All right, well, they definitely deserve that follow. They are doing good. We got some good texturing going on. I like that. I really slack when it comes to texturing. I'm not going to lie. Um, nice little bonsai. Ooh, I like the complexity of this. It's got a lot of depth and stuff going on. doesn't look like it's finished, though. But Oh, yeah. Whip. Walking in progress. Walking in progression. I'm not sure how I feel about this like random gradient over here on the edge. I think the, the wood sort of works better in making it look worn than the stone does. But I like the overall look of this. Oh, this is like another not finished thing, of course. Ooh. This gives me like Game of Thrones and Avatar combined vibes. Like, this is weird, a weird like, mix between them you know that's a good thing though i like that good stuff good stuff um you know what also i'm gonna give that a like this is this is really inspirational stuff i like that it's also just really nice with the biomes what they did i like what they did with the biomes the purpley colors and stuff there so speaking of biomes <laughs> um let me uh close that actually i don't need that anymore put that to the side um so i have a few things that i basically need to sort out today um what did i oh i guess i accidentally closed the the file whoops that's something i didn't mean to do so basically let me uh here. streaming stream archives so um actually no it's not that it is um Oh, right, biome. <laughs> Dumb. All right, biome. All right. So, basically, I had all this stuff. And uh, these are these are some past builds that I did, some past stream builds. And I, I basically, I, I mean, I pasted all this stuff, and then I made the biome. And then I, like, uh, edited it in the, uh, the texture pack to make it look fun um this is probably the best shot of this so essentially i i made like really really colorful biomes and i did that doing um doing stuff with this so let me make this big for you guys basically all right now that's not the right one that i want to show this is the one i want to show you so basically uh the old biomes at least as far as i'm aware 
they sort of had a, a pattern to them and a, a origin or area that you could influence that would change the biome and all you'd really have to do is put sort of like a line over that origin so for this one um that would be whoops um don't actually want to paint it um so yeah jungle is the one that would be influencing this this fun one over here um there we go so this is jungle because obviously it says jungle over here on this that's jungle and if you just cover that whole line with that you know same thing it essentially does what you want it to um and i did a bunch of like gradients and stuff to try and make it fun um and it did it did make me some some obviously pretty cool stuff let me uh the fantasy one yeah so this is what i did to do the uh, the fantasy one these are the the gradients i did to get essentially all of these colors um so those gradients led to this so let me uh let's actually just open these so this one and this one or no sorry not that one um Okay, so that leads to this, essentially. Um, these biomes being covered, and then me sort of mixing and matching the biomes as well. So these are, it's a biome being sort of morphed together. This is like a simplex of biomes being all morphed together. And that's essentially kind of what I want to do with the fantasy one, because I think that'll look really cool. Um, but I, I don't think that the biomes are influenced in the same way or if they are they're influenced much higher up in the air so um, in order to sort of demonstrate what I mean here uh, before I had to basically move all of this up this many blocks so I think this is around 64 blocks or something like that in the air no actually I guess it's only like 20 or so well <sighs> no, that's that's a lie because yeah it's so negative 60 and then we got up to like seven yeah so essentially it's above 64 blocks which is where the normal generation was but now the normal generation is about i think uh was it 64 so i think it, it yeah it should be like 64 above the ground so it should be around here so basically we have to move all of this stuff up to like here for it to actually be influenced by the biomes at least i'm pretty sure and the easiest way to see if that's happening is is this um because this is my my little biome tester thing um but yeah so today we're going to be doing a lot to sort of test this stuff um and make sure that it works because i don't think that the biomes still work the same at least i'm not sure that they do um and in order to test that we're basically going to be going in here and finding all of the uh textures and stuff that we can Find. So, if you're wondering, essentially, this 1.19 thing, if you go into um, dot .minecraft folder, go to versions, and then you go to whatever version you want, doesn't matter, uh, for our sake, this is obviously 1.19, and it actually is dot .2 as well, and then you find the jar, um, what, what, no, go, go away, okay, go, go away, stop, what am I, what, Stop. Close. Yes. Okay. So essentially you find the jar <laughs> and you can, you want to make a copy of it probably and then put it on your desktop. And then all you have to do is extract it and then you'll get this folder. And this essentially has everything you need within a texture pack. And well, everything that's in Minecraft is in this folder essentially. Um, but for our sake, we are just worried about the assets folder and then Minecraft and then textures. So for this, we are looking for biome or color map, sorry. That would be what the biome is. And I wanna see if we replace these with the proper thing. Um, in fact, we actually, we only need this one folder here, so we can actually just delete all this other crap. That, okay, and let's go ahead, let me delete some of this other stuff, um, just so that we don't have to keep 
find me. You don't need any of this because this is all, all of this stuff is in here by default, by the way. So if you're making a texture pack, this is fine to get rid of all this stuff. Um, delete the realms and stuff. Don't need that. And we're basically just going to get rid of everything. Except for those folders up there. And delete. Any day now. And then I actually need to grab the one. Grab oh, while that's loading, I mean. Open a new window. Realizing the free music is a pain. Alright, there we go. Um Window 19, uh, resource packs, new pumpkin. So basically, we need to grab this and this. We'll copy that. Actually, we'll just copy the, copy that, and uh, blank. Wait, what? Open this. All right, there we go. And then we gotta plop that in there. So pack dot into meta we got to edit this and we basically pack format and make sure all this is correct i think that should be fine honestly um okay and now we go into assets minecraft textures uh let's go ahead and just get rid of block as well because all we really need is color map whoa that's weird that's which is so screwed okay um, oh crap, my 2D thing is been closed. Okay, that's okay. So foliage and grass. I think all I want to actually replace is the foliage one. So um, let's go back. This and basically, um, want not that actually. I want copy. Um, fantasy. Just, just the foliage. Copy that. Delete this one. Pop that in there. All right, and then we should be able to go. This. Let me uh, edit the name of this and call it Fantasy. Not nice of that too. All right. And let's go ahead and just copy this whole thing and see if we can throw it in there and if it works because it should, but I'm not sure if it will honestly. Um, I think I might need to change one of the settings for the. NC meta thing, the dot NC meta. Shader packs, uh, paste that in there. Oh, whoops, that's not a shader pack, I'm dumb. Pfft. There's a difference, that's a resource pack. Uh, paste that in there, okay. Options for resource pack, and it says it's incompatible, so that's, that's not good. I think it's this one because this is the. Um, hmm. Yes. Done. I think we might need to change some of the M NC meta settings actually. So. Oh! Well, okay. I mean, it worked, sort of. It did replace these uh, these leaves, I guess. It did it did do what it's supposed to. It did make them purple. So there is that, but it's not 
the uh, gradient that I was hoping for. Um, there should be like a, a gradient and stuff going on with this purple. It shouldn't just be purple. Yeah. Um, so perhaps, let me um, search some stuff here really quick and see if the Minecraft, if, I, if there's anything updated. Minecraft biome. Um, just do the wiki and see biomes in Minecraft. Um, okay, so. That doesn't really help me that much, honestly. Um, a select few pixels are considered when, yeah, so. Um, I assume I need to adjust some of this stuff in the pack somehow temperature downfall because that might actually let me do like a gradient um, plains forest I mean that sort of gives you like a map of where everything is sort of but not really also not really helpful still um I don't remember. I mean, not going well. <laughs> so basically, I used to be able to make a gradient super easily with just those lines, and I'm really trying to look for just these lines right here, and I'm really trying to look for another sort of map of this. Um, I don't really know what to look for though, honestly. It's just not. Uh, super clear. Oops. Not the computer. Uh, no, don't save that. Thank you, though. Okay, uh, let's go one more time here. Biome. Boom. Okay, so This should technically work, and it shouldn't be just giving it a uh, weird purple. And I think that's whatever this is, so that will correlate to which biome? Plains. Okay, so Plains clearly is the, the purple one. Um, I guess the easiest way to test this is going to be to do like a, a simplex biome over what we already have, so go in here and with the same texture pack that we already have we're just gonna we're gonna select these leaves this chunk of leaves and we're going to go um that oh wait right 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 we got to make sure we're doing the right biome so we need planes um So we need planes, uh, that birch forest? I want to say that's birch forest. And then, um, forest. Actually, let's not do forest. Let's just do jungle and birch forest with planes. Okay, so jungle and birch forest. Okay. So, basically, we just go boom. Boom, and for place, or no, set biome. Um, I think you can do this. Oh, wait, let me, um, easiest way to get back to it would be to go to my old commands, of course, so. 
fantasy plant tree wait no what was the middle one there fantasy uh no shroom forest nope that's not what it was okay uh can't remember what I called the just maybe biome stuff biome yeah this set simplex let's do this oh yeah that would be it exactly so that's essentially exactly what I mean. simplex and then we should be able to get rid of that um let's do F3 plus A load things that did nothing um I did do birch forest in jungle, right? Yeah, in plains. Yeah, it's definitely correct. So let's get rid of. Um, the the L two D thing. Or actually, you know what? No, because that that still should be relevant. We uh, let's try one more time selecting all of this and just kind of giving it a good stack. First of all, we're just gonna do that. So that it's in the air further. Just in case somehow the the height of the world is impacting the biome influence. Because that is a thing sometimes still. And I could be uh, yeah, look what oh wait. Whoa. What? Okay, okay, wait, 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 wait. Alright, alright, so. Let me actually let's go to the uh, the original one. The, uh, where is it? That's just not loading fast enough for me to see if I'm flying towards. Basically, the other the smaller one that I was showing before should be around here somewhere. Yeah, this one. Uh, so this is the one that I took a bunch of screenshots of, and essentially I think. Oh wait, let me let me look really quick. Is it? Yeah, it is going all the way down. So this time it is all the way up and down from zero to. Or negative 64 and 319. Um, first, second. Um, let's just do expand vert. And let's do that same simplex replace. And um, I'll just reconnect. It's easier, honestly. That way it reloads the biome. Mmm! Mmm! Okay, yes, it does work still. Nice. This looks good. Just as it is. This is fun. I love it. Alright, so, essentially, now that we have sort of the biome thing still figured out, I want to figure out um, a better way to well, also, we need more purple in there, for sure. But I want to figure out a, a better sort of color combo for us to put on the uh, gradient with the fantasy trees, because, hmm, yeah, these, these are going to be good. Um, let me go to some of the trees that we're actually going to be using. <laughs> these are the schematic brush tutorial trees. Which is very close to being done. Very close. I am literally... Uh, importing it to YouTube, the final, hopefully, final version into YouTube today, tonight, and this week it shall be posted. Um, gotta run it by the, the actual dev one more time with the Schematic Brush, just make sure they're on board with it, and then, yeah, we're good to go, honestly. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm so excited to show you guys the power of the Schematic Brush. And then, of course, uh, I'll be making a tutorial for the, uh, the grid selector as well, coming soon. Um, okay, so, which is the one that was unfinished? This one, this is the unfinished one. I'm gonna change this one really quick. This biome. But I'm gonna make it different. I think I'm missing a biome in the, uh, yeah, in the thing. I wanna add some. Um, and Bert. Let me 
see if did I there should be more than yeah one of these things so fantasy stuff here we go uh, birch forest let me um, let's get the thing go here we go so these are what we're looking for so we need jungle forest birch forest and plains to be in it forest birch forest plains jungle is that jungle forest birch forest and plains. yeah I think we don't have birch for oh you do have birch okay yeah this one definitely has all of them it seems so let's do this one that's why you save commands guys by the way so you don't have to figure it out again and again and again just this reason right here all right uh let's relog so it's file for us take long Whoa, that's a lot of color going on. So obviously the um, spruce leaves don't get affected, but like, ah, hold on, let me um, let me do a type replace for that real quick. Um, now let's make this real quick. So, honestly, hold on. Let me um. I want silver. Yeah, this is gonna be worth it. This this is gonna be worth it, guys. Yeah. Oh yeah. This isn't even the uh, the final version of this build, but. Those colors, though, just like a nice gradient right through the tree from blue to purple to sort of a grayish and then like a nice light green to a green. So fantasy. This is ideal. Like, come on. Obviously, this isn't even the... Oh man, I I almost have to do it to the the original version now. I feel like I gotta make a copy of it before I do that though, of course. Man. Alright, do I have enough room to stack this thing this way? Or, I, mean, I don't care about any of these trees. They're uh gonna overlap this, yeah it is. Dang it. Alright, well, we can just make so, boom. Oh, uh, yeah, we can stay tight with the selection for now. Shouldn't really matter. Also, I, I found this shaders. It actually has volumetric clouds. You could actually fly above and around the clouds. I love it. Oh, man. You have no idea how fun this is to just be able to fly literally through the clouds. Oh, so fun. So fun. All right, sorry, I'm getting distracted. Um, we'll go down the ground. Copy. And of course, depth of field is always nice. <laughs> That's for like taking screenshots and crap. Post. Okay. Um. Actually, I think I can probably paste it over most of this. Is there anything over here other than this? Yeah, we can paste it over this. Okay. This is just my, like, testing to paste things area. Or it was. We don't need that anymore. We should A. Oh, wait, crap. I think I copied it from the other corner, which means it's going to paste in the wrong direction. We'll undo it in a second. We need it to face not that way. We'll just uh, rotate a negative 90 degrees and then do the same thing. 
because that's essentially where I want it to go. <laughs> this wall over here. Sun. Okay. So. Now let's reselect this. We just need to. Oh boy. Grab the corners. Boom. Expand. And then we can just paste this in here one more time, and that should fix it for us. I just really want to see the like original ver or the, the finished version of this with that fun simplex. I also want to see it with this other simplex that I made. I don't know. I don't know what that is, but I think that might be good too. Um, yeah, this is the this is the play around one. This is the test. Um, I actually. I want to see the difference of this with like green grass and stuff and then versus like having the biome grass also be the same thing we can do that so first things first i think we gotta reconnect with the biome yeah there we go okay so i want to see what happens if we essentially replace all of this with um Uh, I'm actually going to get rid of that too right now. So essentially, that I want to replace grass one as well. So we'll copy that. And we'll go to 19 resource packs, fantasy pack, assets, textures, block. Oh, no, wrong one. Whoops. Fantasy 1.19.2 makes more sense. Minecraft, textures, color map. Uh, we'll go ahead and just delete that, plop that in. Oh, wait a minute. That might screw things up. Because I just saw that the grass one has like a white chunk at the top. But hopefully that doesn't. We'll see. We'll see what happens, honestly. Okay. So, uh, was it F3 plus T should reload the texture pack. And, yeah, nice. Okay. I mean, for this, it kind of just it works um i want to see what it looks like with that other simplex though first uh let's get some nice screenshots of this because i just it's just like cotton candy it's it's weird you know i love it so nice um also again this is still just planning for the the forest that i'm actually gonna make i hope you know that this is not the actual forest that i've made this is a forest that i made a long long time ago named the nature walk um or the forest path, I guess. It's a more visual version of it. But yeah. Um, this is not the uh, the official forest that I've made. Has to be a little, just in case you're wondering. Um, Alright, so... Yeah. Let's do the other simplex down here. Boom. Disconnect. Reconnect. Okay, yeah, so this one definitely has more purple chunks in it. I like that. Let me, um... Uh, let's do, like... Uh, let's do new. Then I guess we'll just see. Okay. Wow, that's much brighter. Holy moly. Look at all of that color, though. Holy crap. Just a puke fest. 
Honestly, I mean, when you're flying up like that, it's like a lot to take in. But when you're just kind of like in a little spot like this, that's not bad. That's not too bad. It's a little, little more something you can actually tolerate. But it's still just with these, uh, these pine leaves. I'm definitely not going to be using pine leaves in the, the real, real build. Um, yeah. So. Boise ID. Good caller ID. No idea who's calling me. Leave a message. Um, and then this is the other one with just the purple, I guess, now. Huh. Okay. So, yeah, I do like this. And we're definitely going to have to make our own simplex. But I really like the biomes that are already here. So, I think this is definitely enough to make it fun. Like, just this blue and just that purple together Mwah. perfect i love that so yeah we're we're definitely going to be using this to our advantage for the the fantasy build um and basically all we had to do was exactly what i just showed you that i did i literally just took the 19 1.19 jar uh unzipped it and then um deleted a bunch of crap threw in a dot mc meta from a previous uh, texture pack that I had and if you're really concerned about that all that's in that let me um, go to the texture pack really quick resource packs this is all we did so all I really did is delete everything in there and then add this and all uh, all this really has in it if you're really curious is this um, oops that. well not full screen that's not helpful so the the brackets the pack quote unquote more brackets pack format too i'm pretty sure pack format actually needs to be like seven or something for it to be default for um one not 19 it might not even be seven it might be a different number i'm not gonna lie but basically it works so it doesn't really matter um and then if you want you can change this to your own words um so we're gonna call this actually the fantasy uh forest 2.0 Oops, don't want to hit enter. There we go. And we're going to go save that. And that should do the trick. Boom. Let me do one more F3 plus T just to make sure it still works after we did that. Nice. All right. Yeah, still works. Um... I love this build. I'm so happy with how this forest came out, just in general. Even even not talking about the biomes and stuff here, like this forest is just fantastic. Um, I actually really want to see what this forest looks like with the other biomes really quick before we end the stream today, because why can't I move this? What is going on? What? Ah, I, I literally couldn't move this program past this for some reason it was like not letting me that was really weird like i couldn't move it this way just, i just wanted to move it left <laughs> and it was like no this is in the way this website this this uh chrome <laughs> tab is just it's too much i can't move left i literally had to move this and then i could move it anyway sorry Computers are fun. Computers are great. I love computers. It just Windows is is the best. Apple does nothing wrong. Windows always. No, I'm just kidding. Obviously, both of them suck. I just anybody who says one is better than the other does not use both. All right, because neither are better than the other. Both suck in their own ways. All right, Apple sucks in its own way. Windows sucks in its own way. Both have really awesome features and both have really really shitty stupid features. That no make no fucking sense, all right? Both of them, both are shitty. Both are great in their own way. Windows versus Apple is a stupid ass argument. Sorry, I'm getting on a uh, Pluto rant, all right? There you go. There's the Pluto rant of the day. I hate it. I hate people that are just like, Apple is better, Windows better. No, neither are better. Neither are good. Neither are best, all right? Neither are great. Both suck in their own special way. 
all right? It's like, it's like, uh, <laughs> it's like hating people. You can either hate everyone or hate no one, all right? All right, anyway. Um, I'm kidding, I'm getting on a stupid rant. So, <laughs> fantasy things, I want to put, uh, I don't need that anymore. I want, what happened to my folders here? I need, go back into here, biome stuff, and we want, I think it's this one that's the normal one. Nope, not blocks. Um, oops, color map. Yeah, this one. So, copy that. And... That to get into here. Minecraft textures block. Oops, dang it, I keep hitting the wrong one. Actually, you know what? Let me go back in here and let me just delete this one. Because we do not need it. Alright, there we go. That that should help me click on the right one. Minecraft, textures, color map. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and just get rid of this one. And that one in there. Okay. Uh, actually, I think I want to... Is the yeah okay I want to get this oops I want to put this the original grass back in there too so delete that pop that in there let me um let me also plop this grass one in the original thing so where's it um fantasy. Or, where am I? Here we go. So, biome stuff, and yeah, we'll just throw that in there. Because that is an important thing that has changed. See, the grass one from before was definitely not like that. It definitely had, like, the top biome part as well. Back in 1.16 or so. Alright. So, now we should just be able to go F3 plus T. That should give us a nice orange leaves sort of look to it. Let's see what this. Ooh, yes. Yes! Fall for the win! Oh, yeah. And that's. This is honestly even more. Oh, wait, wait, what? I thought I. Hold on. Options. Uh, go back a bit. Did I not put the grass one back? Oh, I didn't. Okay. Whoops. Pop the other one. Okay, there we go. Done, done. Back again. Yeah, we don't want the, the ground to be weird like that. So, F3, T again. Really need to see what this 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 looks like with, like, the fall. Because... Oh, yes. Yes! Hmm. Let me go. Let's go fly above it real quick. I'm actually, I think I want to put the other, um, simplex on this one. Let's see what that looks like. Whoops. Over there. Uh, so back to the, the first simplex with the, uh, the extra file. So this has birch, plains, jungle, forest. Oh, that does have all four. Forest, birch, jungle. This one just has them, like, re- kind of want to just see what this looks like compared to this. So, let me let me actually take a screenshot of this first. That's really nice looking. Very cool. Um, also, I'm realizing that this tree, this tree should definitely not have birch leaves in it. This one. Two. Per this place. Birch. With, let's just do both of these. Okay. Yes. Yes. That is much better. That tree definitely has to be a uh, not 
So birch, if you didn't know, birch and uh, spruce leaves are the only ones that aren't affected by biomes. Um, in fact, I'm pretty sure that we need to test these real quick. So I think azalea leaves are affected. And then, um, so let's see, azalea. Oh, no, never mind. Azalea leaves are not also, are also not affected by biomes. So just good to know. Uh, let me see, leaves. Uh, what is the other one? Mangrove. I don't think mangrove are either. Oh, no, they are. Oh, okay. I didn't know mangrove leaves were affected by biomes. So essentially there are three leaves that are not affected and now every other leaf is. I didn't know mangroves were affected by biomes, but they are. They definitely are. That's amazing. In fact, you know what? Let me um Let me undo that last one. And then let's go replace birch leaves with mangrove leaves so that it's like a different kind of leaf in there. You know, cuz this is a special kind of tree. Uh hold on. I think I screwed up the selection. You know what? Let me just let me just do it with everything. Let me let me reselect the whole thing again because I'm gonna have to do that anyway. Boom. Also, uh, I'm trying to see if I can start to stream. Um, well, I guess no, never mind. I was gonna say I might I might start streaming in like uh, higher resolution, but the truth is I won't be streaming in a higher resolution. I will just be recording things in a higher res resolution. Um, and then maybe uploading those things later on in that higher resolution, which is just 2K. It's not nothing crazy, but it is higher than 1080. Um, so, play, oh wait, we gotta do, let's perch, leaves with, so, leaves. Okay, yeah. Definitely worth it. Okay, so let's see what that other simplex looks like real quick. Um, actually, let me, let me just see really quick. What's the next one? The... Not sure what this one is. I think I just might have copied and pasted the... Okay, never mind. Okay. So yeah, let's go to the first one that has a couple more things in it. Copy that. Copy. Oh, wait, what? Did not show copy there. Copy. Floppity. Okay, let's go to vlog. Honestly, relogging is just as fast as like another thing that I could do, like teleporting away or something. Okay, this has definitely got a lot more orange in it, orange and red, than it does yellow and green, which I'm okay with, honestly, that kind of works. Honestly, with something like this, I would sort of try and get rid of half of the leaves, I think. I think that would look better. But overall, like, let's just, let's just go for a walk. Let's go from corner to corner and just kind of get a nice little thing of our... Thing. I would probably also replace a lot of these taller um, ferns and grass blocks. So the large grass, uh, or what is it? Um, large fern, tall grass. That's that's what it is. So the large ferns and the tall grass, I would I would replace with um, the, the shorter stuff. Uh, the flowers, I might get rid of these taller ones if I were doing this. I think. We could do that. I mean, we did make a copy, right? So, <laughs> um, nah, we won't. I don't. I don't have the motivation to do that today. I just wanna. I wanna walk through my paradise of a forest and uh, get Oh, wait, 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 let's get this. 
this view right here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, Christ in there. All right, let's take that screenshot. That's a good one. Welcome to fall, my friends. <laughs> oh, I love forests. Forests are so fun. Let's take that screenshot right there too. So much going on. So much to look at. So much to just take in. Yeah. Look like right here. Oh, that's a good one. That's got like stuff in the distance there, way out. Let me, let me, uh, let me get a, just a smidge of the like grass and stuff in my um. There we go. Ooh, that's nice. That's nice. Got that like focus look. Let's let's take one from here too. The grass at the bottom there. That's awesome. Ah, <laughs> uh, man. Uh, I'm so, so proud of this forest. Um, anyway, so, I know it seems like I made a forest today, but I did not. Uh, this is a forest that I had already made before. This is the nature walk. It's available. Oh, well, not available, but you can see more about it on my planet Minecraft and stuff. Um, on there as well as Getchfab. But, for now, this was basically just a bunch of different tests to see if I could actually use the biome um, gradients and stuff still because, yeah, uh, as you can see, it's just, when you get close up to this stuff, oh, just beautiful. Just beautiful, especially with shaders, but even without shaders, honestly, this is a fantastic, fantastic. Um, so yeah, the biomes will be happening. I will be doing that for sure for the fantasy thing. Um, I might even make some more, some new stuff, some new colors for it because I think that might be worth it. But yeah, I definitely need to do that. Um, and we're going to be next time, next week, next Saturday, we will be making some more, um, trees and stuff, some new trees for this. Uh, essentially we're going to be using the purple and stuff texture pack with that i might make the textures first before we make the trees but regardless we're gonna be having a field day with that i actually really quickly before we end up today i have a thought that it just came to me um i'm unsure if stuff like the um glowberries the vines specifically do those wait yeah there we go uh, no, they do not get influenced by the biome, for sure. Those are still very green. Okay, cool. Just wanted to make sure that, that it wasn't, um, seems like you, I guess, I didn't know you couldn't put those under, um, so there's also this, I assume that's also not, but then there's also, uh, just regular vines. Are regular vines? I can't remember if regular vines are influenced, but yeah, they are, okay. Regular vines are, those aren't, and obviously the gold berries aren't either. So we could use some vines every every so often in the real, in the fantasy one to kind of give it some extra flair, but not sure if I want to do that or not. We'll see. Um, yeah, yeah, for now, with that, thank you all for watching. I am sure you know how the buttons work down there by now, so do click them as you please. If you want to see more of this fun texture back stuff, Look forward to it next week because I will definitely be continuing this next week. I love forests and I love making them. So, yeah, with that, thanks again for watching. 